about oh, 20 years ago or so when the school first opened, I applied for and received a grant from the DNR called a Conservation Partners Grant. Um, and we were awarded uh, $20,000, 10,000 of it, which had to be in kind match, so really 10,000, to try and restore this land uh, in front of us to a back to a native state. Uh, it was left fallow. It was uh, part of uh, an agricultural field that was abandoned. And uh, as a result of the abandonment, uh, invasive species, and mostly the, the two biggest culprits, uh, our reed canary grass and Canada thistle, came in and just overtook the, the land. Uh, reducing its diversity and its overall uh, health. Um, and so uh, the idea behind the grant was to restore it to a tall grass prairie. It's been a challenge. I wouldn't say it's been a huge success in terms of, uh, of actually turning it into a tall grass prairie, but there's, there's a lesson in that too. Uh, ecosystems don't come back necessarily the way you want them to once you disturb them. Um, but uh, the initial plan was to uh, blast everything with herbicide and then uh, hopefully kill it off uh, and then plant it. Well, it didn't go very well because uh, those plants still live underground even though they look dead on top. Uh, and uh, anyway, so it was me on a tractor basically um, uh, put with a seed driller in the first uh, couple years. And uh, we did some removal of trees, stumps and whatnot as well. Uh, a lot of seed collection, students going out to native prairie sites around the Twin Cities, Bunker Park, uh, Rum River Central, other places that have prairie restoration, they would collect seed and bring it to the class for a little extra credit. And uh, so that was kind of fun. Um, we've had a couple different projects from scouts that have been out here, uh, both a, uh, a Boy Scout and a Girl Scout did their, their, uh, their final award, the Eagle Scout and the Gold Project, were done out here in different spots. Um, and so yeah, the idea behind this is to use an actively managed prairie as kind of a teaching tool for students to learn about uh, invasive species, uh, ecosystem diversity, uh, human disturbance, and just what we can do from a restorative perspective to try and bring ecosystems back.